Dubbo Sims and Dubbo Macquarie were the last two teams standing. A couple of rivals that always produce fireworks. Sims went in as slight favourites, having beaten Macquarie three times already this season. The rain would have been a welcome sight for the Fishes as well. But despite all that, it was Macquarie Raiders who scored first. Yeah! The league's biggest star coming out at night, David Peachy attracting four defenders before crossing the line. That shook the defending premiers into action. Winger Epa Navali looked certain to level the scores for the Fishies, but in a massive play, Peter Boone managed to hold him up. Sims kept coming, but they couldn't get across the line. This was turning out to be an old-fashioned arm wrestle up front. McCroy went to the air, and when Sims were pinned for being offside, the Raiders took the two and led by six points to nil at half time. The rain continued to tumble down, but Macquarie still put it through the hands for captain Craig Roweth to score. When two fishes collide, the result was a headache for one, but that was all forgotten when Justin Yeo reached out to score. The conversion from Luke Jenkins hit the left upright and went in, and it looked like the tide was turning for the Fishies. 10-6 they trailed, but that was soon cancelled out when the Raiders made a break down the right. An inside ball touched by Sims for Peachy to grab try number two. The never say die attitude of Sims was in evidence right to the end, but Macquarie were good enough to hold them out. At 14 points to six, the referee blew full time on the 2008 season. In the lower grades, Sims down Ningen in the Tigers' first ever grand final appearance, while Macquarie took out the under-18s. But in first grade, it was Dubbo Macquarie who were crowned new Group 11 Premiers. Marcus Chapman, Win News. It was a hard loss for Sims to take after being first into the decider, but their opponents, well, for them it was time to celebrate. Macquarie was keen to acknowledge all the work that was put in throughout the year, particularly by its popular coach, Jim Kelly. A stalwart, a legend, a good mate. Um, there's not much, there's enough I can say about the man. You know, not just Jimmy, like the whole Macquarie club. You know, Mark Murphy. The, the list is endless. Gavin Board. They're all top blokes, administration supporters, as you can see today. So, no, it's absolutely awesome. It's been phenomenal to, to come here and to, to pass my knowledge and experience on.